Alec Baldwin says he didn't pull the trigger in Rust, so the actor said in an upcoming TV interview that he did not pull the trigger of the gun he was practicing with on the set of the film Rust, which fired a live round as he held it, killing the film's cinematographer and wounding its director. And he said in an interview, and I quote, I would never point a gun at anyone and pull a trigger at them. The interviewer, Mr. Stephanopoulos, noted that it had not been a part of the script for the trigger to be pulled in the scene. And Alec Baldwin jumped in and said, well, the trigger wasn't pulled. I didn't pull the trigger. He did not elaborate on why the gun might have gone off during the interview, but it still remains unclear how a lethal bullet got into the gun that he was practicing with and why the crew members who handled it before passing it to Mr. Baldwin failed to detect that it contained a live round when it was supposed to have only dummies. So in the interview clip that's going to be airing tomorrow on ABC, Alec Baldwin said he does not know why a real bullet, which was not even supposed to be on the property, was loaded into the gun. Now, investigators are trying to determine whether the supplier of the blanks and dummy rounds for the movie sent live ammunition as well, according to court documents filed on Tuesday. For further investigation, the police found out that the armorer on the set of Russ, Hannah Reed, told a detective that she had loaded the gun with five dummy rounds before lunch, but that, and I quote, there was one round that wouldn't go in, so she cleaned it out after lunch and added a sixth round according to the notes that were filed on Tuesday. Now, throughout this entire process, Alec Baldwin has been emotional about what happened. And during the interview, he said, and I quote, she was someone who was loved by everyone who worked with her. And he was visibly emotional while he said that. And he said, I think back and I think of what could I have done in that moment? Now, this is the first time that Alec Baldwin has given his full account of what happened to the public. Last month, two crew members who were in the room when the gun went off filed separate lawsuits naming Alec Baldwin, the film producers, and other crew members as defendants. Both lawsuits alleged that Alec Baldwin should have checked the gun himself to see if it was safe to handle. Again, the interview comes out tomorrow. But what do you guys think about the situation? Make sure that you guys comment below your thoughts and keep the family of Helena Hutchins in prayers as well and make sure that you guys stay safe. And I'll catch you guys back here next time for some more Taylor Talks. We're on the road to a thousand subscribers. So thanks everybody for subscribing. And if you haven't already, make sure that you do click on the subscribe button. See ya.